Post Mike with Certified Radon Mitigations, and what we're going to do today is we're going to install a radon mitigation system. We have our sump pit, our sump pit discharge, and we're going to pour a hole in this corner right outside from the foot. inside a sump pit, whereas a homeowner, if they have to change their sump pump, then that'll cause problems for them. So what we do is we try to avoid that. Go ahead and assemble the fan, the couplings, and the way it's going to go up against the house. We've done this inside today because it's uh, actually 20 below zero here in Indiana today. So this is what we've done. So we're going to try to make our time outside shorter, going ahead and putting this together. This will connect to the house. We got our pipe roughed in and we're going to run our wire. It's all roughed in and ready to go. Basically, we got the inside finished now. We did the, uh, we sealed it with plexiglass. This is actually a clear caulk and it will dry clear. Um, so, all the white will be clear when we're done, when it's dry. Um, we got the pipe sealed up. We got the, all the labeling on with the power to the fan. All of our stickers, radon reduction, tells you to test every two years. Um, this is a manometer that shows the uh, water column per inch, shows that it's working, and it's also dated. So here's our system finished on the inside. All right, here we are. We got our finished product outside, our radon fan up with the two clips above the eave, and our sump pump. We had to redirect this around and uh, redo some of that. It's all sealed. And, uh, that's it, basically. Um, so if you need any radon mitigation, this is